Today, this video will be on the back in the insert for a Delmatic in inches. Today, we will I will show you how to do the back pattern in the insert for the neck. The front piece is a little more involved, so I'll do a separate video on that one. Okay, we'll need a piece of fabric, 45 inches long by 52 across. I'd like you to take the fabric, fold it in half. The, because um, the sleeve in the length is wider, so fold the wide, wide part, the 52 inches, so it'll be 26. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to, it's on the fold line here. Now we're going to make the top. We're going to take the T square and we're going to run it along the fold line of the fabric. Then we're going to take a yardstick and we're going to run it along the top edge. And from this corner here over, it should be 24 and a half inches. Draw a line across 24 and a half inches. Now you'll take the two square and you're going to run it along the top. Make sure it's square on that corner there. Then you got to draw a line 10 and a half inches from the corner down. Once that's done, you're going to turn it. You want to make sure it's along that line, nice and square. That your sleeve will be crooked. And you're going to run a line 13 inches long. So this will be the sleeve. You can double check before you make your next mark. Make sure that this is 10 and a half from here down. Okay? Make sure that's 10 and a half. Now we're going to turn it. Okay, make sure it's on that line. Use your yardstick for the extension. So from the top to the bottom, it's going to be 29 and a half inches. So you draw a line, 29 and a half inches. This will be 11 and a half inches across, so you can. Double check it, 11 and a half, 11 and a half. Now we're going to do the bottom line. This will be 11 and a half. You can also check with the length to make sure it's 40 and a half inches long. Take your yardstick, start at the top, forty and a half inches. Okay. That was relatively simple. Now we're going to do the insert for the neckline. I just used a piece of paper, you know, 11 and a half by eight, right? Okay, measure half inch here. Once you've measured the half inch on that side, make a line seven inches. So you have the half inch here and 11 to seven going up. You measure five inches up. Here, here, draw a line across. Now at that seven and a half, seven inch line, 
go three and a half, three and a half. Here's the end here, three and a half. This is the center. This line here will be 10 and 3 quarter inches long. Now you're going to take a plate, 8 inch plate. Measure from side to side, 8 inches. Place it down and draw the curve. Okay. On this template for the Delmatic, this line here will be the shoulder line. So where your seams are for your shoulder, this is where you would, the placement would be. So that's it for the two pieces. I will make another video on the front. Good luck cutting.